Hello, I'm Sean Tempesta, and this is the Morning Blend Extra. Are you upside down on your mortgage, but you wish you weren't? Well, there's help, and it's available. And here to show us how to reduce your payments and stay in your home is real estate and certified distressed property expert, Late Levada. He is a broker with First Prime Realty Group. Welcome in, sir. Good morning. So let's talk about this. People that are upside down on their mortgage, they want to stay in their home. What do they do? Well, there's a couple different options. One option is the loan modification, and this is where they had submit to their lender to either reduce their principal or reduce their interest rate or both. Okay. And uh, there's not a whole lot of principal reductions happening, but they are out there and they are available. The other options that they can do is a HARP program, and this allows them to refinance, decrease their interest rate, lower that monthly payment so they can stay in their home. The third option would be a short sale buyback, and that's where they get their lender to short sale the home sell it to an investor, and then buy it back in the future at, let's say, three years uh, based on market value. That's pretty remarkable. How, we're, we're going back to that first uh, point, how much of a mortgage reduction are we seeing when it does happen? On the modifications? Yeah. Oh, it could be large. Uh, usually, they only go down to 115% okay. of the value of the home. And I, I, how would a homeowner qualify for something like that or for something like buying their home back? Well, they would need to submit to their lender. They need to go to somebody who does the loan modifications. We can help with that. Uh, and they also need to submit for the short sale as well. Pretty much the, the paperwork is pretty much the same okay. um, for the short sale or the short sale buyback. Now, the so short sale buyback, how do I know if I'm leasing the property back from whoever purchased the home? How do I know that I'm going to have an opportunity to buy it back at the end of that lease period? Well, we do all the paperwork up front. Okay. So you know the terms of everything that's going to happen. Right. From the get-go. You're in the, I like to say you're in the driver's seat as the homeowner on the short sale or the short sale buyback. And this could really be a life changer because you don't have to, the act of moving is single-handedly the worst thing right. ever. Your kids don't have to get up and move and change schools, leave their friends. This is a great opportunity. Right. And uh, a lot of people don't like other people walking through their homes. Oh, boy, yeah, of course. Uh, what, what does it cost the homeowner when you short sale your home or do the short sale buyback? What, what's the cost of the homeowner? Well, if you work with me and my company, we do not charge anything for the short sale. And the short sale buyback is a tag along to that, so that's completely free as well. But the lender ultimately pays our fee for service and our commission at the end when it closes. So we don't make a dime until it closes and the homeowner doesn't pay anything. Well, the, 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 the feedback you've been getting from people must be great. The fact that they don't have to get up and move. They actually have options now. Oh yeah. Yeah, of course. Now let's talk about uh, your radio shows. I know you're on the radio, right? Yep. Oh, it's, uh, there, there's a lot of them. Yeah, yeah, there's quite a few. Well, let's talk about the shows. Well, we have a show on Saturday okay. in the morning from 7 to 8 a.m., and then another show from 1 to 2 p.m., and then on Sundays again at 4 to 6 p.m. And there are still a lot of people, despite the fact that we've seen a lot of growth in real estate over the past year, that still find themselves severely upside down and in the need of help. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we still see people upside down double what the home is worth. So wow. they bought it for 200000 it could be only worth 100000 or 400000 It could be worth only 200000 mm -hmm. So they really need to come in and, and see what the home is worth to see what their options are to see where they need to go because they might need to do a strategic default. And that's where the homeowner may make enough to pay the mortgage, may have enough in the bank, but they just need to do something because they're upside down. And it's a terrible investment for them to be making. Right. Yeah. And there is the opportunity to do something there as well. Uh, is that what you see a lot of your callers on the radio show calling in about? the fact that they're upside down, they want to know what their options are? Right, exactly. Uh, I, I, are the options better now than ever for, for people that are upside down on their home? Because five, four or five years ago, they were almost up the creek without a paddle. Right. I think so because the lenders have more programs. It's more streamlined mm -hmm. so people know what's going on. They have their systems in place in order to deal with with this issue at hand. And if they have any questions, they can call your office. Almost oh, certainly. We offer a free consultation, so just give our office a call and we'll talk about the loan mod, the short sale, or the buyback. All right, Leith, it's a pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, if you'd uh, like more information on short sales, foreclosures, the short sale buyback program, anything real estate related, really, just head to the website or call the number on your screen. Leith Lovada also on Facebook and Twitter. The number on your screen, 476 2000, LeithLovada.com. Have a great day. See you tomorrow.